Hi, I'm Sylvie Di Palma. I have a multicultural uh, background as I was born in Italy and I grew up in Australia, in Sydney, and now living in Lyon. I just uh, I started uh, painting quite lately, it was in 2010, after I worked at the University of Lyon for 25 years. I wanted to uh, do my, what I would have loved to do when I was young, when I was in Australia, because when I was 12 years old in high school, uh, we did painting, so I saw all the big painters that you can, uh, you can think of, Turner, of Van Gogh, and so when I went to uh, the uh, Quai d'Orsay Museum back in uh, a couple of years ago, I just cried in front of the, uh, of the auto-portrait of uh, Van Gogh. And uh, as I worked, I, I couldn't paint, but in 2010 I asked a friend of mine, who was a painter, and I said, Noemi Gomez, I said, Noemi, teach me to draw, first of all. So I started uh, drawing, and then she told me, but you must find your style, what you like to do. So one, uh, a couple of years back, I did my first abstract painting, and he said, that's your style, you should continue with that. My inspirations come from the uh, Aboriginals in the Outback, where I went a couple of years ago also to uh, visit the uh, Aborigines and see my family in Sydney, of course. And when I came back, it was just uh, amazing, that really inspired me. And uh, as I also went to India, and uh, there are the Wali, the Aboriginal Wali's in Mumbai, and uh, for example, they do paintings on the walls of their houses. For example, a special a ceremony, a marriage, uh, 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 of all uh, what they do in the house, and they paint it on the wall, like the Aborigines in, in Australia. And then there's the Gond also, the Aborigines from the, the, uh, the eastern part of India, and uh, they do paintings, for example, and uh, not for, to show them or to sell them, I say that when I look at paintings, what we do, I feel happy. And that's what I want to uh, share with uh, the, the friends or even with children, I uh, taught painting with them, uh, to show them that with uh, two, three colors, with a canvas, you can do an artwork. Of course, simple, but I think they love it. For example, I do paintings also with combs, uh, acrylic paintings, with combs, with balloons for the pouring, and uh, they absolutely love it. And for example, uh, I had uh, the mother of a friend of mine who had cancer, She's in Pol she was in Poland, and um, when I taught her how to do, uh, just uh, to paint like the mandala, just dot uh, 20 years, but dot painting. And she said, Sylvia, when I painted that, I didn't, uh, I didn't have any pain. It was like it was another world. And that's what I want to share with people. And that's what I'd like to do. For example, this painting, Dream of Venice, my uh, dream was to come to Venice to exhibit. And thanks to the curator of this exhibition, and also to Julia, the project manager, who helped me all the, uh, the, the work to uh, eventually to exhibit here. And I want to thank them, of course. But that dream of Venice, I did a couple of months ago. And I never thought that would be here in Venice. Okay. This is, you see, this is what I do. What I love is colors. As you can see, uh, this was for um, a friend of mine. And she told me, Sylvie, just do a painting with a lot of colors. And that's what I did for her. And um, as you can see, this is the masks in the net. That this is done with uh, liquid pouring also. That is with, with soap liquid, you know, and uh, what I like to do, and I put some masks in it. And that's black and white, that is what I, I like also to do, just two colors. I like to paint only with two or three colors, acrylic colors, and, um, and it gives you a dimension that you don't have to, uh, how do you say, to uh, do a lot of things, you know, just do something simple, and it comes out like that. that. I, hope you, I hope the people who look at that will enjoy my work.